Folks, hello and welcome to the latest in our series of Farm Video Diaries. My name's Robert Hull and in this particular video we're, we're going to look at the Hill Farm Centre and what's been happening there. Uh, we'll take a wee look at how the calvings went uh, this season to date, bits and pieces of issues we've had with the calves on the sheep side then, a bit of an update on, on how lambing has went uh, and what we've been doing at the minute in terms of clipping sheep, weighing and dosing lambs and uh, a wee bit of OPA scanning too. The hill itself then extends to about a thousand hectares, largely a blanket bog, but there is 140, 150 acres of good land on the lower sections of the farm. It's a stock rearing farm with calves and lambs going down to uh, the beef and sheep centre and the dairy centre for finishing. We aim to wean 100 calves per year from this farm, so that means we'll calve down about 104, 105, 106 cows. We had an exceptional breeding season last year where we had 94 of our 98 cows and calf and when you add that to the heifers that, um, that were due, we calved down about 120 this year. Calving itself went reasonably well. On the plus side we had a very tight calving interval starting about the 12th of April and by the 8th of May, say 8 weeks later, we would calve down 111 cows. Uh, there were some big days within that. On the 22nd of April we calved down 9. And there was 10 calved on the 4th of May. On the downside then, we'd lost 4 or 5 calves down to difficult calvings, despite using an e easy calving bull. We'd also lost 4 or 5 calves with like a ill thrift. Um, we sent the, the blood samples away, thinking it was maybe a vitamin E issue or something, but it turns out it was maybe a touch of fluke or even, even a touch of a neospora. So over the next week or so we'll be pulling the, the, all the, the, the cows and heifers into their breeding groups uh, aiming to get the bull out or the bulls out by 10th, 11th of July. The farm also carries about a thousand ewes and with an exceptional lambing this year, uh, 910 ewes lamb producing 1,561 lambs, so that's a lambing percentage of 172%. Uh, the downside of this is obviously the ewes are going to have to try and rear all these lambs on, on, on the poor mountain pasture and we've kind of got away with this year in terms of the good weather and the dry spring has, has really helped that. Last week then we started clipping the sheep and while we're doing that then we'll also uh, weigh lambs, dose, vaccinate uh, and get them ready to go back out again. We tend to clip about 300 or 350 sheep in a day. And this batch of ewes we're looking at here have raised singles on an area of the farm known as the Creve. The ewes have done fairly well, they're in reasonably good condition. And the, the lambs have, have done really well too. Uh, whenever we weighed them, they averaged 34, 35 kilos. The heaviest of them were 44, 45. Uh, so we're really pleased with how they've done on, on, on coming down from the higher reaches of the farm. Folks, that's just been a couple of minutes on what's been happening at the hill. Uh, thank you for watching. For more technical information, please visit the Caffrey website, our Caffrey TV channel on YouTube, and our Instagram, Twitter and Facebook feeds for more information.